Yo, what is up everybody? Silky Creamy in the house. So glad you folks are here. Welcome in, welcome back. I've got a big smile on my face for three reasons. One, because you folks are here. And I really appreciate you guys um, stopping by and checking out my channel and checking out my content. Two, because I'm doing another PAA um, scent review, which is becoming one of my, I mean, not becoming, it's always been one of my favorite artisans uh, to review. But three, because this is actually the first time where I don't have the scent notes and it is something where you can't really get um on the website and you can't order it um uh, this was a flash um sale per se um anyway before i get into that welcome in to those that are new my name is silky creamy and i do very niche review videos um buckle your seat belts because we're gonna have a little rocky rocky video here because i don't have any information for you folks uh if you're returning i appreciate you so much welcome back really appreciate all of you so as i mentioned a little while ago this is a scent that is not available on the website you can't order it it was only available um and of, on a flash sale um via the mobile app from phoenix artisan accoutrements i'm an android user and so i have the android app and when i went i ordered this uh was it last week um yeah i think it was last week like maybe seven or nine days ago and i received this a few days ago but now i'm reviewing it and i've gone on the website i've gone on the android app and i am searching for the soap to be able to read the notes and it is not visible you can't see it um so i unfortunately this is the very first video where i do not have the description um from the artisan from Douglas uh, to read to you. So I'm just gonna give you my first impressions. I remember some things from the, um, when I opened it up and I looked at the scent, I remember a couple of notes. One of them I don't smell. Um, I have, to be honest, I smelled this already uh, right before I started pressing record here, um, just because I obviously am a little flustered with not having any information. So anyway, um, we'll just get started we'll just get started so i was um obviously one of the first 50 to get the ck6 bundle so we have the holographic label um and i don't know if there was only 50 available because obviously it's not available on the app um but here you have it folks camp phoenix which um you can actually get merchandise um t-shirts of um with the camp phoenix logo on there but there's no shave soap or product to be able to purchase um when it comes to, to this scent so just understand that so anyway um we have the um what do you call this i want to say um bigfoot maybe it's the what do you call that not indestructible man god you guys know what i'm talking about anyway you have the loch ness monster you have the cube obviously you have the pine trees almost like a um in the forest and you have the tent and you have camp phoenix established in 2012 with your phoenix shaving logo and you got this um almost um if you didn't have this holographic label here i think it would be like your um southwest colors and print in a sense so anyway, um, the scent on this, folks. Anyway, let's take a look at the pour. I feel almost bad doing this review because you can't get it. Um, but I'll do it anyway just because it's, uh, yeah, it's something that was offered. Maybe it'll come back. Uh, it'll be offered on the website. Um, you know, maybe this was just, you know, available to people who had the app Um and they were able to get in early and then this will be released to the public in in the future but anyway beautiful pour look at that that's beautiful anyway the scent that's coming off already this is a very strongly scented um soap as always when you uh consider the offerings of pa it smells like a campfire um so this has a very um the scent of burnt wood after you had a campfire that's what you get from this. It 
has a very, very, um, um, almost like a fireplace um, smell to this. And so this actually smells like burnt logs, um, which has a beautiful smell. But one of the things that was in here that um, I can't pick up, but I remember seeing was like raspberry. Um, so there's raspberry in here, but I don't pick up the raspberry scent. Maybe it'll be in the uh, aftershave. I haven't smelled the aftershave yet. But again, this is a campfire. Think campfire. Um, the smell after, you know, when you're sitting around a bonfire, um, what your um, clothes would smell like. That's what this smells like. So it has a very, very unique uh, um, experience that comes to mind when you smell this. So that's Camp Phoenix soap. And as we go to the aftershave, it is a clear liquid. And in here you've got uh, denatured alcohol, vanilla bean hydrosol, interesting. Aloe vera, willow bark extract, and benzoin resin. So let's open this up for the very first time. Looks like we have a orifice reducer here, which I think is gonna be standard now. Okay, so this, Okay, folks, this has a vanilla and raspberry, and this is a beautiful, beautiful scent. Wow. Okay, so that's what I'm smelling. This smells like a bonfire, okay, which is a beautiful, you know, it's a nice scent. This has a sweet, almost um, cookie. It almost has like a cookie smell, and that's the vanilla bean. But there's like, you can smell like hints of like, I picking up berry. And when I, this is amazing. When I breathing this in, I actually have this sensation in the back of my throat from breathing this in. It's actually like, wow, this is really, really good. Ah, this is so different. The scents are so different. This is a really, really nice, sweet smelling, um, scent and this is a very smoky bonfire type of scent i guess together would really smell like i guess what you would smell like after doing s'mores maybe i don't know anyway i hope you folks enjoyed and i'm so sorry i don't have the notes um or any like description from from douglas and from the website to really give you details on this but um it's not available so that's this is my impressions and um, as always, I'm glad you folks stopped by and hope you folks enjoyed and um, hope you guys have a great week. And always remember that sometimes we have to go through darkness to be able to appreciate the light. And um, that's I'm talking to me right now because I've been through some tough times recently. And sometimes you go through that and you come out and it's bright and you find the light and you really appreciate things for what you have. And so oftentimes I think we always lose fact and or lose sight of what we have and when it's suddenly ripped away we we're just feeling that despair and so always remember to take care of one another out there and always treat people really nicely you never know what they're going through and you never know that your words can really either uplift or bring someone down and let's try to uplift everybody you guys have done that for me and so I'll I'm doing this for you as always, that's my feelings, and I really, really appreciate all of you. So take care. Have a great week. And aloha. Peace.